Hello, everybody. This is Grace from WorkAnywhereNow.com. Uh, today, I'm going to show you how to schedule a YouTube video and how to embed it into your scheduled WordPress post. Okay. Now, when you oh, first of all, the scheduling function in YouTube, you need to be a YouTube partner first. What that means is that you need to be um, apply for AdSense and connect your YouTube channel to your AdSense account in order to have this option available. So once you become a YouTube partner and um, have that mon mon uh, mon monetization option available for your videos, then you can have the scheduling option, okay? So, uh, the first thing you need to do is when you are uploading your YouTube video, whether you do it directly on YouTube or um, from a different app that you're using for your uh, videos, make sure when you upload, you're uploading either um, private status or scheduled status, okay? So those are the only the, the two um, statuses that you should upload initially. That's very important, okay? Now, so here is my video. I, ha I had um, uploaded on private. So once you're here, you can get this scheduled. You can choose your dates. So I had chosen my date earlier. So that's the 24th. And I actually want it at 6 a.m. So once you hit that button, everything saved and it should um, public or make it public during that time. Now, how do you get the embedding code? Because right now when it's scheduled or if it's private, both of these um, statuses, when you go to your video to try to get the embed code, Hello everybody, this the share options are not available here. You see that? It's gone. So it means that you need to put it to enlist it first and then go to your video again and then your share option is available now. You see? So you press share, go to embed because you don't need that. This is a direct link to your video. You don't need that. You want to copy your embed code. Now, there's more options here for your video to embed. So I always use these two options, show player controls and show the video title and player actions. Um, you can use whatever you want. You can use there. Uh, check the boxes that you want. So after you check the boxes, then you go and copy everything and or highlight everything and then copy. Okay. Now, let's go back to the video. Um, editor here so I'm inside this again so let's see if I could put it back to so see once it's unlisted the schedule is not available anymore okay so I'm gonna put it back on private press save wait a little bit and let's see if the schedule comes up it does come up now I could put it back to scheduled now, if you have these options here um, for your G Plus and your, I mean, Google Plus and your Twitter, you can actually um, put a message here. And when it goes public at your day and time, it's going to also um, send out messages to or post your tweet and your post on Google Plus for you at that time. Uh, right now, I'm not going to do that yet. So I just save um, changes. So, I don't know why, but earlier I was trying, when I was testing this out, I just want to give you some tips or whatnot that I, sometimes it doesn't work when um, I go from private to unlisted and try to go back to um, private and then schedule. Sometimes it didn't, it didn't work for me, but I don't know what reason. And then now it works. So, if that ever happens, you're just going to have to... Um, delete your video and then re-upload it because according to you, like if th that function doesn't work, like even if it shows up and it, 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 
allows you to press the button. You have an error right here that says you can't um, schedule a an unlisted video. It'll have a, a red message right here. Um, so when I was just trying to test it earlier, that's what happened. So, but when I tested even before that, it works. So I don't know what happened. <laughs> I'm doing the same steps. So I just want to let you know that can happen. Okay, not that my instructions here are not good. <laughs> so, but the moral of the story is that when you first initial upload, always do private or scheduled, and then you could grab your code um, by going to unlisted. Grab your code and then go back to private, save it, wait like just a couple seconds, and then and then try this option again and see if the schedule is available. If it is, click on it and then save again. And hopefully it should work. As you can see right now, it, it worked when I went from enlisted to private to scheduled. So never touch the public if you want to do this kind of scheduling, okay? Um, so once you have the code, you just go to your post in the text um, tab here of your editor and go to the spot where you're going to insert your video. Um, oh, sorry, I had already done it here. So you just paste it here. Uh, I have the, these other codes on the top of the video. This is to center the video up into my post. So it's less than sign div space align equal quotation center closing quotation and then the greater sign. And then closing the parameter here using less than sign forward slash div and greater than sign. So and that should show up there. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna save this. If you get into any problems of going to enlisted to grab the code, if that doesn't work for you, just leave it between private and scheduled. And then what you can do is go to a, a different video, okay? Grab the code. So if you have the code somewhere else already of a different video, you could basically use that same code and just change this part, okay? So there's this part here. So this is the URL for your um, video. And what you want to change is not the entire thing. You see there's a question mark here. So from that one character before that is these little ones. So it's, it's after embed forward slash, there are some characters there. You will go to your video direct link right here and you would just copy just the crazy characters in the back. Oh my goodness. Why is this not? letting me oh well it's not letting me anyway you just need from from the forward slash uh, those characters right there and copy and paste it into like another bit another embedding code that you have already or you could just go to your list of videos and whatever um, public um, videos that you have you can use that embedding code and just switch out those um, last section of characters and that will still work for your embedding code okay so now you're going to have your scheduled post and your related video all go live at the same time okay so i hope you like this video i'm sorry if i'm a little long-winded right now but i hope you like it um, if you do please give me a thumbs up please and subscribe to my channel and uh, leave me a comment if you have any questions okay so thank you so much and for watching my video, uh, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you soon for my next video. Bye.